What's up everyone and welcome back to Movie Race. Sonic the Hedgehog 3 First Look From Sonic the video game we played as kids to Sonic the movie, we've all come a long way right before our eyes. The third installment of the film has also been confirmed. Is Dr. Robotnik returning as the main character in the next installment? You'll receive all the answers to your queries. When both Sonic the Hedgehog and Sonic the Hedgehog 2 established that Paramount could be trusted to bring Sega's Blue Speedster to life, the buzz surrounding Sonic the Hedgehog 3 movie news and updates became apparent. The Sonic franchise is one of the most well-known in gaming history, with the namesake Blue Hedgehog rivaling figures like Mario in popularity. Despite a few early setbacks such as the ugly Sonic fiasco, Paramount has established a great cinematic universe for Sonic, which has been both critically and economically successful. This was followed by a successful sequel and the announcement that Sonic the Hedgehog 3 would be released. The budget for Sonic 1 and Sonic 2 is around $90 million and $110 million respectively, and they collected a whopping amount of about $320 million and $405 million at the box office, respectively. After the premiere of Sonic the Hedgehog in February 2020 to mostly positive reviews, Sonic the Hedgehog went on to become the most successful video game film adaptation ever in North America. Due to its popularity, Sonic the Hedgehog 2 was produced quickly and launched in April 2022. In the sequel, Sonic and Tails work together to defeat Dr. Robotnik and Knuckles, Dr. Robotnik's new sidekick. After that movie's debut, which received significantly better reviews from critics and viewers, rumors regarding Sonic the Hedgehog 3 started to circulate. The most recent Sonic the Hedgehog 3 movie updates indicate that there is still enough world to discover from the video game source material. Before moving further, do not forget to like, share, subscribe to the channel, and press the bell icon for the latest updates. Speaking of updates, the updates for the Sonic the Hedgehog 3 film are somewhat slow until 2023, when the new Sonic film's development and marketing picked up. The most recent information regarding Sonic 3 was provided by franchise writers Pat Casey and Josh Miller, who confirmed progress on the next Sonic the Hedgehog sequel, but did not avoid providing any specific detail about the type of plot they were crafting. The writing team informed supporters that the movie was looking good and that they should start getting excited about it despite the lack of any concrete confirmations. It appears that the third installment in the franchise will continue this trend of the movies expanding the scale and scope since Sonic the Hedgehog 2 definitely broadened the scope of the film and opted for a greater adventure with each film. Sonic the Hedgehog 3 was confirmed months before the second film's release. In addition to the sequel announcement, there was also word of a Knuckles offshoot television show. Clearly, the company placed a lot of faith in the second film performing well, which it did, making the early announcement of a third film a wise decision. Given the rapid turnaround between the first two films, it makes sense that Sonic the Hedgehog 3 is progressing even while the second film is still fresh in fans' minds. Sonic the Hedgehog 2's end credit scene was also a significant hint, as it hinted at the appearance of one of Sonic's most popular palette-swapped foes, Shadow. Sonic the Hedgehog 3 is set to be released on December 20th, 2024. While the first two movies had success in their first quarter releases in 2020 and 2022 respectively, it seems as though the studio has some increased confidence in the franchise with the third movie getting a holiday release slot. While no fresh Sonic the Hedgehog movie updates regarding the cast have been published, several of the franchise's established characters are expected to return. Ben Schwartz's Sonic is currently the sole confirmed character to feature in the upcoming third film. Naturally, the Parks and Recreation alum will return as his portrayal of the eponymous hedgehog has grown synonymous with the character since his debut in the first Sonic film in 2020. Colleen O'Shaughnessy got to bring her talents to the big screen after years of playing Sonic's industrious fox companion, Miles Tails Prower, in her theatrical debut in Sonic 2. While the character has not been confirmed to return in the threequel, Tails believes she has established herself in the cinematic universe and will appear in any future films. 
Idris Elba of the Suicide Squad and Thor franchises brought his talents to the realm of Sonic, appearing as a fan favorite video game character Knuckles the Echidna. Knuckles will almost certainly return for Sonic 3, given that he was poised to get his own spin-off series on Paramount+. Jim Carrey as Dr. Robotnik is one candidate that appears to be a long shot to reprise his Sonic role for a third film. Carrey, who plays the main adversary in the first two films, has stated that Sonic the Hedgehog 2 will be his final acting job, telling Variety, I have enough, I've done enough, I am enough. Plus, Carrie's mustachioed villain was considered dead with the destruction of the giant Eggman robot at the end of Sonic 2, so it stands to reason that the actor and character would not return. Despite the fact that his destiny was left somewhat vague, a comeback is not out of the question despite Carrie's apparent retirement from acting. Producer Neil Moritz stated that they would never even try to recast the part if Carrie did not want to return. However, he and co-producer Toby Asher told IGN in April 2022 that they would love him as long as he would like to be there with us. In terms of human characters, it is likely that both James Marsden and Tika Sumter would reprise their roles as Tom and Maddie Wachowski, Sonic's human family. Natasha Rothwell, who plays Maddie's sister Rachel, and Adam Pally, who plays Wade Whipple, the deputy sheriff of Green Hills, are also expected to return. Meanwhile, given his function as Robotnik's sidekick, it is unclear whether Lee Majub's Agent Stone will return. There have been no Sonic the Hedgehog 3 movie updates about the plot, although Sonic the Hedgehog 2 hinted, that, hinted at where things might go next. The film's conclusion revealed the game's notion of Super Sonic, which is Sonic supercharged by Chaos Emeralds, which might be explored further in the third feature. Furthermore, the film concluded with Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles as a trio, with Sonic the Hedgehog 3 promising an adventure with all three characters together from the start. Sonic the Hedgehog 2's mid credit scene introduced one of the game's most well-known characters, Shadow the Hedgehog. As a result, Shadow will most likely serve as the major antagonist in Sonic the Hedgehog 3. Shadow's entrance also lays the groundwork for the arrival of other game characters, such as Rogue the Bat, Shadow's long-standing gaming partner and another anti-hero. The scene also implies that Robotnik escaped with the military, assuming that he had died while his minion, Agent Stone, was still present. Is this a signal that Dr. Robotnik is still alive and may return in the upcoming parts of the movie? <laughs> I don't think so, and after Carrie's interview, I'm also very sure he's not coming. What do you think, guys? Let me know in the comments. The Hedgehog 3 has yet to receive a trailer because filming has not yet commenced. Given the film's December 2024 release date, it appears likely that the first footage will not be unveiled until mid-2024, along with a glance at some of the additional Sonic characters from the games that may be introduced in addition to Shadow. As we come to an end of this video, there are still a lot of unanswered questions. Is Shadow going to be the villain in Part 3? Is it possible that a great notion of Super Sonic will explode in this installment and that the story of the movie revolves around this? I don't know what you think. Am I able to catch the plot? Let me know your view in the comment section. Thanks for watching the video. We'll see you at the next one.